Hey, what's up guys? I'm back with another Marvel Legends figure review, and this is the brand new Marvel Legends series special edition comic book, three and three, four inch uh, scale figures. We got shield wielding heroes, and I don't know who this guy is. I know this is Falcon as Captain America on the right, but um, I don't know who the guy in the back is. He says, he says his name is Vance Astro. If you guys can let me know a little bit of information on who this guy is, not too sure. It says the defenders of justice join the front line in battle with shields in hand and hearts set on victory. Now, all these figures were um, available at Toys R Us. You can see them right here. These are the other three or other two, but I'm a fan of Captain America and I wanted the Falcon as Captain America. I think it's great. You have a Secret Wars comic right there. It says Marvel Custom Edition, not for resale. So it looks like they're bringing back the comic um, packs again, which is pretty cool. I always liked the Marvel Legends, uh, small, the three and three, four inch scale figures, but let's go ahead and open these up and we'll see how cool these guys are. All right guys, so here we have Vance Astro outside of the packaging. Again, this is a character I'm not too familiar with, so feel free to give me some information on this character. But here's a quick little 360 look with him and his shield. Here is Falcon as Captain America. Now these figures do have a little bit of a, an issue that I can, I'm gonna wanna say right off the bat when we get into um, the next cut. But here's a 360 look at Falcon. Or I should say Captain America. Get into that. I'll show you the comic book that these guys do come with right here. So you can see here is the comic, Secret Wars. It's on some nice you know, print and everything. Um, of course, this is just like a custom, it says on the front. And you have, you know, it shows the Marvel Legends series here. I actually kind of ripped the back taking out of package, but it's got the new Onslaught wave on the back. And then again, it's just a really cool read of this right here. So if you guys, you know, are interested in all that. So we have Vance Astro right here. And I can tell you guys right here, the, only, the main problem I have with both figures is the shield. Now the shield, the little clamp right here is a little flimsy. You can see it right there. So when you, it doesn't clip on that great, at least mine doesn't onto the wrist and it falls right off. But you have the shield right here. And um, it's, I mean, it's a decent shield. I'm pretty sure it's a reissue of, you know, other shields from Captain America, but him and Falcon share the exact same shield. Right here, it's a pretty cool looking figure. You can see he's just, all like a dark blue. It's got a little logo right there with like a star and just white. It's got the muscular body. Very nice paint applications, but he's pretty plain as far as anything goes. He doesn't have like a lot of detail going on or like a, a really crazy looking outfit. So he's just pretty much like a whitish and blue. Hopefully the camera will pick that up, but a pretty cool looking figure. You can see the head sculpt right there. Looks very nice to the wide eyes. Now in the way of his articulation, the arms do go in and out, forward and back, a bend at the elbow, lower arm rotation, nothing at the wrist. The head can rotate and go slightly up and down, nothing at the waist. So he doesn't have a rotation at the waist or an ab crunch. Legs go forward and back, but it looks like it's like the Captain America Civil War to pop off. You can go forward and back, in and out, double jointed at the knees, and the, fit, the foot can go up and down. It's got the ankle pivot. And he does have peg holes at the bottom. So that's, um, what is this guy's name again? Vance Astro right here. But I'll show you what I mean as far as the shield goes. So it's flimsy, like I said. You gotta put a little bit of pressure under so it won't flip out. And then there you go. But it's very loose on him. But here's Vance Astro. Now we have uh, Captain America, Falcon as Captain America. I really like this figure. I think this is the one to get out of the set. Hopefully we get this in the six inch form. So you have the sculpting on here, which is very nice. You have the little belt, the white and the blue and the red. You have the star right here. Again, all this is sculpted on. Great little detailing in the gloves and the shoulder pads. And then he's got a lot going on right here in the back. So you can see all that detailing and the, especially, you know, everywhere throughout the character, throughout the whole um, outfit, the pouches, the wrinkles, the sculpting and all that. And you have the boots right here. So you can see the, all the little sculpting in that. Look at that. Just on a lot of amount of detail and you have the knee pads and you have um, detail at the bottom of the boots and peg holes but we'll look at the head sculpt here so he's wearing his goggles you can see the black hair there and he's got kind of like a half halfway uh, covered mask you can see right there you can still see the ears but a very good looking head sculpt I like how this came out and again he does share the same shield and it is a little flimsy as well but as far as Falcon's articulation goes, Falcon, Captain America, whatever you want to call him, the head can rotate. It go, this one actually does go up and down. The arms do go in and out. 
You can see that right there, forward and back. Bend at the elbow. Lower arm rotation, nothing at the wrist. He does have rotation at the waist. No crunch though, the legs don't really go in and out. If they do, they will pop out. Forward and back, uh, double jointed at the knees. And he's got the, he's got the ankle pivot. So he's got good range of motion. Here is a little size comparison with the Captain America Civil War figure, with, which is the same uh, scale as these figures right here. Okay, so there's my review. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, today we're taking a look at the Marvel Legends. It's, you know, it's a comic pack. They're bringing back the comic packs and the uh, three and three, four scale inch figures, which was like the Marvel Universe uh, scaled figures. But um, these are hitting stores. There is another set, which is the Thor one. And uh, I forgot who the other one was. I think it was Iron Man. I forgot who the other set is. I threw the package away. But overall, it's a decent set. If you guys are into these scale figures, then I definitely recommend you guys pick them up. If you guys are just Captain America fans like me, then I do recommend you pick it up because I do want, I did want a, um, a Falcon Captain America. The only problem I have with these figures, like for instance, Vance Astor, I can't get him to stand. So he's kind of leaning on uh, the Falcon right there. And the shields aren't that great. But the detail on there is really good. Articulation is a little weak, but you guys let me know what you guys think about these figures. Hit that like, subscribe, and share button. We'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.